Okay, we're gonna be tying a zug bug here today. It's gonna this great pattern, easy to tie, works great in uh, pawns for bluegill. And uh, we're gonna tie it up for you on a size 10 bead beaded uh, nymph hook. I'm gonna wrap our thread back to the to the bend end of the shank. We're gonna take a peacock sword, is what they're called. Well, we're going to pluck off probably four, three or four of these. Cut them off, pluck them off. You want these uh, about as long as the shank from the bead to the bend. And these are, I love peacock, Harold peacock, swords, that color, that dark green color. Looks really cool. Now we're going to take our thread probably about mid shank. We're going to take three or four uh, peacock harrows, depending on the size of the fly. You might want more or less. I like a big body on mine, so I'm going to take four. Size this is a size ten nymph. Wrap that to the back. We're gonna clip those off and I'm sorry if my camera goes out of focus, it does that every once in a while. I'm gonna take our thread to the right behind the bead. We're gonna twist these perils and stroke down so it fluffs them up. Wrap. I have a rotary vise so I can just spin it. We're getting real big body. Pretty pretty thick body. And you want to leave a little gap right behind the bead. Tie that off. I accidentally missed a hair, but that's alright. Cut it off. Now you're going to take a hackle, brown, black, anything, and we're just going to pick one, suit it, so make some legs. Don't want very long ones. Just gives it a little bit of movement in the water. Strip away all that bigger fibers. Right, right behind the bead, cut it off. Now we're going to take our hackle pliers, put it right on the end, wrap it, three to four wraps, just so you can get some nice legs on there. And wrap it, tie it off, right behind the bead. Got it. Pull these back and give it a good couple wraps in there. Now what we're gonna do is you're gonna pull down on the bottom and you're cut all these top hackles off. All those top fibers. Push it back, give it a couple wraps. Make sure you get them all. It's just the top ones. Now you're going to take mallard flank, like a feather, like this, any color, you're going to tie it right in that, right behind the bead, real tight, so it's on top, that's your wing case. Now cut it down to size. To cut it, just cut a little bit off at a time. That's a little big. And one more cut. Right there. Right there. There's your uh, wing case. Now all we have to do is take our whip finisher. 
tied off. And that's a zug bug. Really good pawn fit pawn fly. Thanks for watching this video. Check out my channel for uh, some other fly tying. And be sure to subscribe because I'm gonna have a lot more fly tying videos up soon. Watching Hardway Outdoors.